thank you for joining in once again we're talking about serving god and serving him well um and today i want to focus on partnership or unity um uh, and i think uh today more than ever there is uh, so much talked about teamwork and um, you know there's so much talked about um uh you know complementing one another in in um, uh, various tasks so we understand this we understand that partnership is uh, important and unity is important to accomplish uh, bigger and greater things even in the kingdom of god you no know, unity is very important now uh, we see in scripture that in the body of christ each one of us forms a different part just like the human body you know the human body um, has eyes that have a, a certain function uh, and the same body has ears that have a completely different function but both are equally useful and in the same manner in the kingdom of god or you, you we might want to bring it closer home let's say the local church you know, we have people who serve in different ways you know somebody could be a teacher while somebody else could be in administration somebody could be a, a creative person while another person could uh, could deal very systematically with finances so god has gifted each one of us differently but just like the human body you know each of us are important in that role that god has given us we cannot replace one organ with the other because then the function of uh, the other organ would cease and we can't do that to the human body and in the same way in the kingdom of god everybody's role is important in the local church everyone's role is important and all of us must must step forward without comparing uh, and in fact by complementing and helping each other uh, i want to take our attention to a passage from ephesians Ephesians chapter 4 and verse 3 it says endeavoring to keep the unity of the spirit in the bond of peace now we are called to um guard our unity we are called to a uh, guard our togetherness we are called to um you know be patient with one another uh, and you know we know that working with people is is definitely not the the easy thing to do we all end up uh, rubbing each other the wrong way sometimes but still uh, you know if we learn to work together if we learn to worship together we can we can do so many more wonderful things for god's kingdom and so uh, the bible really uh, encourages us to be careful to maintain the unity though we are different now we need to maintain that unity so as we are serving the lord as we are ministering unto the lord let's work on also maintaining this oneness and unity and psalm 133 verse 3 it says where there is unity the lord commands his blessing so we can have god's blessing when we serve with unity let's pray together Heavenly Father we thank you for calling each one of us in the capacity that you have Lord and thank you Father that you have positioned us exactly where you want us to be Father we pray that you will help us to appreciate others Lord for their position for their gifting and Lord help us Lord help us to serve you serve one another with everything that we've got Lord um, so that we can see uh lord your work being done in a, in a marvelous way lord we we thank you once again in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally for more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk please visit apcwo.org